it was, in 1975, a film crew set out to make a movie about another famous hairy monster, Momo, Missouri's own monster. I've searched far and wide to track down the only known copy of the original film. That's right, we're going to show it right here tonight. And together, we're going to explore Missouri and get to the bottom of this real case that inspired this should-have-been B-movie cult classic. So like I always say, spin the reel. The first encounter that uh, people attribute to uh, starting the Momo uh, craze, as it were, was in July 11th, 1972, at the foot of uh, Marzoff Hill at the Harrison home. The fellow that saw it first, his kids were out in the yard and saw something on in their backyard uh, up on the back side of the hill on the north side, and it scared them, and they ran in the house and told the father. It bothered him enough that they moved. So I thought, well, I'll just make a little footprint here, and then I'll go in and tell my mom and dad I found a footprint. And I made the impression, and I went back in the house, and I said, oh, look what I found. And somebody came out and authenticated the footprints. Due to the depth of the impressions, they determined its weight and its height, and said, oh yeah, it's definitely from an animal. Mm -hmm. 